advise on initial contact. You have information, Mike. Hey, Mike. Hey. <laughs> John Wayne Airport, ATS information, Mike. 1553 five, Zulu. Wind 360 at 4. Visibility 10. Sky clear below 12,000. Temperature 16, 2.9er. Altimeter 3017. I feel like this is an Visual old Adis. Visual approach is runway 20, right in use. As I was, as I was driving up here, it was information two zero, right in two like zero at uh, 9.30. It is, um, uh, right when we uh, started taxiing Use caution after for contacting ground and switched to plane. Oh, okay. Use caution for multiple trains, various quadrants. Advisory. All aircraft read back all runway assignments and all runway hold short instruction. Yeah, all departing old, uh, general aviation aircraft eight. contact clear until every prior to taxi. Advise on initial contact. You have information, Mike. Ready. Good morning, John Wayne Clearance, Cessna 738 Quebec Bravo. Is that Dove Street? Request left closed traffic with information, Mike. So 738 Quebec Bravo, John Wayne, uh, clearance of squawk of VFR in the pattern and contact ground ready for tech information. Mike is current. You say you're at Dove Street? Yes, we're at Dove Street and we'll squawk VFR in the pattern over the ground. Hey, Quebec Bravo. Just say Quebec Bravo information, Mike is current. We have Mike. Hey, Quebec Bravo. Did I say Mike? Yeah, you did. Okay. Sometimes they just need to, gotcha. you know, they just need to double check themselves. Somebody's holding for you. Okay, I understand they're holding for us, 1106, thank you. Is that all right? Hey, ground, a couple of days Okay. Because that gate should be open. Avionics radio is five minutes or something. Roger. Stand by. We've got a clearance and it is. All right. Taxi area clear. Center right. Uh, 1839, sure. continue via Alpha to gate 9. Alpha to gate 9 at 1839. Right break. Compass Left 5812, break. continue uh, via Alpha, hold short of Kilo. Very good. Alpha, hold short of Kilo, Compass 5812. Compass 4897, coming off of uh, 2 zero right on Echo, we're going to gate uh, 2. Compass 4897, John Wayne Ground, taxi via Alpha, and hold short of I wave Kilo. Them on. Alpha oh, short okay. of Kilo, Compass uh, 4897. Up to 2988, push back approved. Push approved up 2988. 9-1106, have you gotten your uh, amendment for runway 2 left departure yet? Hey, for me, 9 we're ready for two, uh, zero 02 left. John Wayne Ground, Cessna 738 Quebec Bravo is at Dove Street, taxi to Mitchell Vernon. Over 738 Quebec Bravo, John Wayne Ground, hold short of Alpha. Holding short of Alpha, A Quebec Bravo. 1106, contact clearance delivery 118.0. Contact clearance, United 1106. November 8, Quebec Bravo, give way to the Falcon, caution jet blast, taxi via Alpha, midfield run up. Alright, we'll hold for the Falcon and then uh, midfield run up via Alpha at Quebec Bravo. Nice. Caution JB. Jet blast, not just the beeps. <laughs> Sorry. Alright. Runner was, uh, okay, here we go. I think that was me. Uh, me. Alright. Alright, we're gonna get going. Okay. A little bit more power. Good morning, Southwest 5465, Echo 4465, John Wayne Ground, hold short of Alpha for the Cessna right to left, then taxi via Alpha to gate 20. Hold short of Alpha for the Cessna, then Alpha to gate 20, Southwest 5465. 1711, you're holding on the gate for an Embraer to pass and then push back approved. Caution, company going to gate 20. 
All right, afternoon, Barrier Pass is clear to push on below 17, let it look up, company on 20. From here, 5, Charlie Delta, taxi up to hold short, taxi with Bravo. Hey, up to and hold short, taxi with Bravo for 5, Charlie Delta. Attention all aircraft, John Wayne Airport information, Mike, current wind, we're about 6, visibility 9, a few clouds, 2000, altimeter 3017. From here, 5, Charlie Delta, runway 20 right, taxi with Bravo, hold short of Lima. A two zero right via Bravo, hold short of Lima, five Charlie Delta, we do have Mike. Fucking four Bravos here, turn left at hotel and continue via hotel, Are Charlie, we okay? hold short of Lima. That's why this guy? Hotel, yep. Charlie, okay. hold short of taxi. He's not going to blow us off. Here. Nope. Okay. Comes to you know, maybe if he's blasting up, uh, you want to throw an alarm into like their jet blast, but uh, that's fine. 5812, continue alpha, hold short of Lima. Alpha, hold short of Lima, comes 5812. Right, it's out to 1514 at the gate, Mike for the push. Good morning. So 1514 down on the ground. Hold on the gate, verify gate. Those are well, Hold on that gate. And we're at gate 15. Uh, so up there. Roger, expect about 10 minutes. Adjust my seat real quick. 5 Charlie Delta, kind of monitor high. tower 126.8. Alright, take care, 5 Charlie Delta. Fucking 4 Bravo Sierra, monitor tower 126.8. 268, 4 Bravo Sierra. There we go. Ground to 2988. We'd like to taxi to Lima, hold short of 20 left for a crossway air start if able. Yeah. Delta 2988, taxi, runway 20 right, taxi alpha, hold short of Lima. Good. Taxi alpha, hold short of Lima, Delta 2988. Instruments, good there. Set. ESI is zero. Delta 2988, it'll take about three minutes. Thank you. indicator is all checked. And ground control, United Level 6, back with you with Mike, ready to taxi. 9106, John Lane Tower, Roger, I'll get you moving shortly, just got a lot of aircraft inbound and outbound. Alright, Roger that. Elevator trim is set for takeoff. Ground exit, Chesapeake, clearing up echo for uh, ACI. Primer is in and Ground, taxi via Alpha, ACI. Make sure, go rich. Alpha for ACI, exit, Chesapeake, 375. Throttle 1700. Never come to 12, looks like gate 6 is buttoning up, should be pushing in just a second. Thank you. Alright, South Southwest, 1711, ready taxi. Say again? 1711, ready taxi. Alright. Right, Mag. So, 1711, runway 20 right, do the assignment and hold short of the. Go back to 17? Okay. Like a little bit more. 20 right, Southwest, 1711. Alright, do it again. Alright, go back to both. Do the other one. Uh, that one looked pretty good. Put it on both again. Let's see it. That's a little chunky. Nine eight, a little eleven bit. zero six. A little bit. Yeah. Taxi via Alpha. Hold short of Juliet. Alpha short of Juliet. Nine eleven six. All right. Uh, Suction's good. Amateur's good. Trying to burn off all the carbon deposits. Yeah. Of all the students leaving at mixture for too long, or the mixture rich for too long, okay. while the powers at idle. Southwest seventeen eleven. Turn left to Juliet. Hold short runway two zero left. All right, left to Juliet. Hold short at two zero left. All right, do it left. again. Southwest okay. Yeah, it looks good. Do the other one. Yeah, it looks good. Cool. Southwest 1711. I'll check. Add Juliet, back taxi here on way 20 left. Left to Lima, hold short on way 20 right. Oh, Alright, land uh, over there. At, what? what? Juliet. You got some, uh, get on 20 left, back taxi. Traffic. And, uh, hold short of Lima on 20 left. No, no kidding. Southwest 1711, make the turn at Lima to hold short of 20 right. Back to the at Lima, hold short of 20 right. Southwest 1711. Alright, make sure it's lean. Jumpway ground, this is Cessna 554 Tango. Field selectors on both flaps at the uh, primary. Midfield, taxi to midfield run up. Now 1106, wow, turn left to Juliet, cross 2-0 left. Let me go back and do the car beat. I make left on Juliet, cross 2-0 yeah. left, hold short 2-0 right, United 1106. Last two days were pretty, uh, you know, cloudy. And they were. 
I was running car B quite a bit when I was up. Oh, yeah. Ground American 2604. Cessna 554, taking off the gentleman ground. Taxi Alpha midfield run up. Taxi uh, Alpha. All right. Alpha. Midfield run up, four tank alpha. You think we'll be on one one nine four nine or one two three? Contact tower one two three. Pretty busy, huh? Uh, pretty busy. Uh, so I guess one one nine or four nine. United eleven zero six at Juliet Cross runway two zero right. Turn left on Bravo. Hold short yes. of Delta. Cross two zero right. right. Left on Bravo. Short Release. Delta United eleven zero six. John Wayne ground. Cessna seven three eight. Get back Bravo at midfield run up. Run up complete. Ground American 2604 over at gate 6. American 2604, John Wayne Ground, hold on the gate, verify information, Mike. We do have Mike, um, we're holding on the gate. I just, uh, I don't know if I talked to you earlier, we were gonna have to start the engines and then get pushed out and uh, take off pretty quickly, so I just wanna make sure we have a little bit of a window before we do that. Horizon 2895, John Wayne Ground, taxi via Alpha to the gate. Got it now, Golden Eagle 3, Papa Golf. Okay, the aircraft on 3225, change line frequency on 120.8 and stand by. E91106, uh, not sure about the window for the uh, departure, but will you be ready at the end? 1106, affirmative. And 1106, hold short of Delta, monitor tower 126.8. Monitor tower 26.8, short of Delta, United 1106. Delta 2988, are you ready? So 2988, ready for taxi. So 2988, contact tower 126.8. 26.8, though 2988. Got a ground, Golden Eagle, Sweet Papa Golf, where's Atlantic, back to taxi, it's uh, two J's. Yep, stand by. It is busy. And Compass 5812, you're waiting for the option direction, Boeing 717, then taxi via Alpha to the gate. Compass 5812 for uh, gate six. Down with ground, United 842, gate eight, ready to push with Mike, and we're gonna need two left. Two left. Nice. Comes 5812, Roger, and hold short of Lima. Hold short of Lima, comes 5812. And Skywest 4897, verify gate. We're well, we going to gate two for Skywest 4897. It's open. Do you kind of let them run through all the uh, majors until you kind of call back? And just kind of wait for a lull? Just wait for an opening like this. Run over complete, it can make problem. I already said it, so they. Just say it again. Yeah, okay. just check in again. Just be like, yep. November 8, Quebec Bravo, runway 20 left, taxi via Charlie Kilo. Runway 20 left, taxi via Charlie Kilo, 8 Quebec Bravo. Right. Yeah, sometimes they get so slammed, I mean, it's so easy to forget. Right. American if, if time permits, check in again. Okay. American. 2604, engine start is approved, and once that Delta Boeing 717 has turned the corner, I need you to push back and push a beam at gate four. All right, push and push a beam gate four, and uh, I just, you know that we have a quick, we need, we need to get off relatively quickly for our, um, or we're gonna end up having to come back. American 2604, I will try to work that out for you. Thank you, sir. And then, um, they know we're on left close traffic, so they, we don't have to request the option. Grand United 842, gate 8, ready well, we, we push might with Mike it once we're on the downwind. No, no, they, they know we're left close traffic, so they're just going to give minutes. us the option. Looks okay. like about 10 minutes, United 842, hold on the gate. Couple is 15, 14, you're holding on the gate for an Alaska Embraer. Now, if they happen to say push back clear to land, to verify information, Mike. Okay, ask them, are we cleared for the option? If they say negative, clear to land, then land text back. Contact tower, 119.9. 119.9 or 8 Quebec Bravo. Compass 58 to left. Clear for the option. Caution, you have last traffic. Let's get the runways. Clear for the option. Uh, Rogue 2. Rogue 2, verify 2 0 left. 2 0 left, Rogue 2. A down white tower, we've got 267 at 9. Let's get the bottom line. Go ahead, request for exchange. I'm going to come to 799. Radar services terminated. Frequency change approved. See you. Thanks, man. Let's get Quebec Bravo. Down white tower, yep. LA Tower, a Quebec Bravo is turning on to Kilo to hold short of 2 0 left. Okay, Quebec Bravo, Caution, Terminal 737, departed opposite direction off 2 left. Boeing 737, departing 2 0 right. Terminal 2 0 left to Kilo, clear for takeoff. 2 0 left to Kilo, clear for takeoff, a Quebec Bravo. Okay. Finals look good. Yep. Close that window.
Uh, lights. Lights. Camera. Action. Fuel selectors on Action. both. Yep. Primer's locked. So. Okay. Locked. Wind sock. Looks like we got a little bit of a tailwind. All right. So I'll tell you what, we're gonna hold the brakes. Okay. Got 2,000 RPM. All right, everything looks green, looks and green. suction gauge. All right, now we're going to let go, full power. Full power. Got a little bit of a head start, like jumping a whole shot. Okay. And 50, and then there's 55. Rotate. A little bit less. Well done. Really going to want a what? dog leg for all this wake turbulence, okay. so. Alright. You know what's coming on the crosswind? Downwind. Here we go. Clear left. Right rudder. Right. There you go. Interesting. It's going to be a little bit different today given the winds. Okay. That's a great problem. We're 2 left, clear for the option. Caution wing turn one, departed at 717 on the parallel. 2 zero left, clear for the option. Take it back, Bravo. Rope 2, number 2, follow Cessna. 2 zero left, clear for the option. Number 2, uh, 2 zero left, clear for the option. Rope 2. Turn base. That's twenty. Final's clear. That looks clear. Well, it was actually one about four mile final, but okay. you're good. Cool. All right, just watch that airspeed. As you can see, we have a bit of a crosswind to the right. So we're going to want some right the runways are going to be occupying the uh, two because they're a little too big. Constant so just pitch. plan to go around, and uh, they're going to still follow that Cessna. There you go. Good power adjustment. Uh, Rogue two. Uh, All right, now yeah, we're going to take out power. Uh, now we're going to hop a ground effect. All right, now we're just going to hold it. Yeah, so Rogue two, go around and screen. continue to follow the Cessna. They're touching down now. Just like that. All right, Roger, Rogue two. Continue to want to have you run into the wind okay. as we start picking up some speed. 65. Boom. There you go. We're 
Right click Bravo, extend the 15 degree up one. Extend 15 degree up one, eight click Bravo. Rogue two, I'm extending the Cessna. You can rejoin the down one as soon as you're able. I'll get you back in for another one. Okay, Rogue two, we'll uh, turn for a down one right now. Probably turn down when you're now following the helicopter, they're midfield down when. Roger, turning down when, get back, Bravo. The Rogue 2, caution wing turbines arrived at Boeing 737 on the parallel. Boeing 737 will depart the parallel. Caution jet blast traffic between the runways, and we 2 left to clear for the option. 2 0 left to clear for the option. What caution, Rogue 2? 5 0 3 9 John Wayne Tower, yep. Yes, sir, and we're ready. 3 9 3 9 traffic helicopter on base. Uh, 2 0 left to Kilo, clear for takeoff. Caution wing turbines 737 departing the parallel. Here we take off. Two zero left. Three nine. All right, I got the helicopter in sight. Where is he? It's right over there. Just turning. Oh, about to turn five. Oh shit! Yeah. And rope two. If you can square that base turn, that southwest is coming across now. We'll square it up, and we're going to be doing auto, so we'll be shooting for the middle of the runway. Rope two. Okay. Let's make sure. Uh, don't overfly the uh, aircraft off the center room. Roger, Rogue 2. Let's take a quick Bravo, extend the downwind, I'll call the base traffic, we'll be holding in position. Stand down when you'll call my base, take a quick Bravo. Five five four two Alpha John Wayne Tower, two to left to Kilo, line up and wait traffic on downwind. Line up and wait, two zero left to Kilo, uh, four tango off. Let's get a quick Bravo, traffic going to 37 3 mile final for the parallel. Traffic inside, we'll maintain visual separation. Get back, Bravo. Get back, Bravo, visual separation, approved caution, make turn on space turn at your discretion. Space turn on our discussion. Make it back, Bravo. So the 14 level of traffic, upwind helicopters in the pattern, right. and we 2 left to Kilo, clear for takeoff. Caution, make sure one's departing 737 on the furlough. Lapse 10. Clear for takeoff, uh, 2 zero left, we'll keep an eye on the helicopter, 4 tango off them. And 8 click, Bravo, Cessna, 2 zero left, clear for the option. Caution, we turn one's departing Boeing 737 on the furlough. 2 zero left, clear for the option, take it back, Bravo. Yep, on 389, our reader contact, say altitude. 389 is out of 1,200, restricted 3,000. Yep, on 389, our contact, so departure, see ya. Switching, thanks for the help. Wind 2404. Yeah, watch that airspeed. So, variable power approach. Could have a little bit of his uh, wing coming in. Probe 2, caution jet blast the Gulf yeah. in a crossfire to Rapid. Right. Caution wing turn once they will depart the bail off. Probably 2 left, number 2, clear for the option. 2 zero left, number 2, clear for the option uh, with caution. Probe 2. Alright, a little bit more power. This is the 4 tango alpha, radar contacts, the altitude. Yeah. Four tank off of passing nine, uh, nine hundred. Um. All right, let me start left, left rudder. rudder, a little bit more back pressure. All right, hold this. Good rudder application, cool. full power. 
get out of here. All right, I'm going to have a little bit of forward down pressure okay. and some aileron into the winds. Really get that airspeed. There we go. That was really good. Cool. Watch airspeed. And birds are going to die. Oh, man. Just like that. <laughs> you ever had one? You ever had a bird strike? Yep. Uh, I hit it with a prop. Oh, nice. It was uh, something out of the movie. The whole right side of the uh, cowling was just red. Oh, man. You, you got to land right after that, right? Uh -huh. with the other one, baby. You got to land right after that, right? Well, lucky enough, it just hit the prop, so it just shredded. Okay. And the uh, steel prop was unfazed. Oh, wow. So all you heard was the prop. And then just kept going. And end uh, of script. Say again, AK Beck Bravo. Hey, Crew Bravo, uh, you're going to be now following a twin Cessna on a three mile left base for two zero left. Let me know when you got him in sight. Looking for traffic, AK Beck Bravo. All right, three, three mile, mile base. left base, so we should be somewhere over here. Right. We'll be following that guy, so we might yeah, cut him off. I would, I would slow down your forward yeah. speed. So. I don't know why they do this sometimes. Yeah. Uh, so, say quick, we'll make one right 360 for spacing. Right 360, AKB Bravo. Broke two, right, so we're going to have some one. power. Yeah. 15, Broke two. And standard rate? Yeah. The supporting law for radar services terminated squad via far frequency change first. Squawk VFR, frequency change approved, four tango alpha. Zero zero seven at three year wind comp. This is Cessna Quick Bravo number two following a twin Cessna short final. Two zero left, clear for the option. Caution jet blast traffic will cross the runway. Alright, number two, clear the uh, clear for the option, two zero left, AKB Bravo. Probe two turn down one, number three following the Cessna on the midfield, two zero left, clear for the option. Turning down one, right, got the Cessna on side. Probe two. Number three. And row two, clear for the option, two zero left. Clear for the option, two zero left, row three, or row two. And row two, after uh, the option, like the compass rows, if available. Yeah. Row two, it's open, you can expect it. Thanks, row two. Attention, all carbonation, November is current, general, number three zero one seven, wind calm. That's a 5 room with Foxtrot, safe parking. ACI, 5 room with Foxtrot. 5 room with Foxtrot, left at hotel, ground 120.8, see ya. Hotel, 20.8, good day, 5 room with Foxtrot. Hotel, 20.8, good day, 5 room with Foxtrot. Final looks good. Yep. So now we just want to be stabilized. Okay. So good power adjustment. This is looking good. So it's going to get a little choppy. Okay. So just solid, stable movements and rudder control. Looking good. Yep. Looking good. All right, now we're going to want quite a bit more left rudder, right aileron. 
Are we going to stay here? Hold it. A little bit more. Rogue 2, caution, jet blast, southwest cross on runways. You can overfly 2 0 left, then compass rose clear to land, wind at 3 0. Now we're really going to want that right hand correction. We're going to have to taxi back. Compass rose clear to land, runway. We're going to have to taxi back. Yeah. Got to play it safe with crazy wind. That's right. Take back Bravo, see intentions. Taxi back to 2 0 left, take back Bravo. Take back Bravo, left at hotel, 2 0 left, taxi via Charlie Kilo. Left at hotel, taxi via Charlie Kilo. Thank you, back, Bravo. And Echo College verifies 2 0 left. For 2 0 left, thank you, back, Bravo. Yep. Uh, hotel. Yep. So we're on hotel now, yeah. we're just going to try to get on to 2 0 left. Yeah, some good crosswind training, that's for sure. Sweet. Man, I bet Torrance is freaking windy. Yeah, today. it was. I looked at it uh, this morning. Really? It was going to be like. 11 or 12 knots with assisting, I guess at 17. Great. Yeah, Torrance gets windy. If it's windy here, it's way worse there. Let's check. Um, 15 knots. 260, 15. Tonight, Mike Charlie, John, Terry, up. Hey, Mike Charlie, I'm ready. And Mike Charlie, Cosmic, Turbulence 737, departing the parallel. Runway 20 left to Kilo, cleared for takeoff, wind 2 9 0 4. Hey, Mike Charlie, cleared for takeoff, runway 20 left. Bravo, we're going to be 2-0 left to Kilo, line up away. 2-0 left to Kilo, line up away, you can look Bravo. So we're going to want to stay on the... Oh well, yeah. Yeah. We can line up away, but you want to follow the taxiway right. center line. Uh, why I got off there. Alright, final looks good. The lights, camera, action. Full ridge. Thank you, Bravo, traffic up, winds and eastbound departure, caution, we've turned once part of Boeing 737 on the parallel, and we're going to be 2-0 left to Kilo, clear for takeoff. Two zero left to Kilo, clear for takeoff. Hey, Quebec Bravo. Looks like stuck there. All right. Lights, camera, action. Twenty. Wind. Full power. Full power. We're really gonna want that right aileron. Airspeed to left. Rotate, instant dog leg. Yeah, just like that. There it is. One, three, two, four, four, one. Huh? Alright, traffic's inside over there. That's not a Mike Charlie, we're to contact the altitude. Hey, okay, Mike Charlie, what's that speed? Or 797 Sierra Tango, John Tower, you ready? Uh, 797 Sierra Tango, yes we are. 7 Sierra Tango, traffic upwinds in the pattern, Cessna, 2 0 left to Kilo, uh, clear for takeoff. Here we go, 2 0 left to Kilo, clear for takeoff, 7 Sierra Tango. The center, my Charlie, contact, so Cal departure, see ya. Hey, okay, bye, Charlie. Bravo traffic TBM, five mile final for the parallel, and we two zero left, clear for the option. Alright, we'll be looking for traffic, clear for the option, two zero left, AK back Bravo. Now, will they always ask you to report traffic in sight? Yes. Okay. Even though he did, he just said, beware of the traffic? Uh, was it for parallel? Yeah. Now, if it's departing, or, you know, five mile taxiing, final TBM. Yes. 
That, yeah, you have right. to let him know. Um, traffic inside. Cool. If they're in the air, if it's like just, you know, caution wake turbulence departing right. traffic, then you just say Roger or caution wake turbulence. You got the TVM at all? No, it's a tiny little single prop at a five mile final, right. so it's probably out at four miles right now, right. which is kind of ways out there. Turn base. You fly the airplane. Oh, I see it. Stop, get tight. Take it back, Bravo. Yeah, a tiny little guy. We'll maintain this little separation. Take it back, Bravo, Roger. Seven zero tango, we're to contact the LT. Uh, Nine hundred restricted, two thousand four hundred seven zero tango. Watch any uh, YouTube guys? Steve O. Steve O. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, that's uh, yeah, some cool videos of yeah. his TVM. Looks like uh, winds either a straight headwind or a downwind. I think it's headwind. All right, gonna want a little bit more right in the round. No, I was wrong. No one. That was flawless. That was yeah. flawless. Even with a tailwind, I really didn't do much there. Good shit. Oh, look at you. What I do? Like a pro. <laughs> right, up chain. Ground, we're the 15 degree upwind. There's gonna be an opposite direction departure. Send 15 degree upwind. Take it back, Bravo. What? Bird. Nah, I, just, I like making noises randomly. <laughs> <laughs> cool, I'm not the only one. <laughs> oh! <laughs> See? Little, little updraft. Yeah. Thermal? Yep. Yep. Oh, yeah. <sighs> yeah, my wife wants to come tomorrow. I don't know if you're going to be well enough, though. Well, I hope. Yeah. <laughs> I hope, man, but just I just want to play it safe, you know. Yeah. Alright, number seven three tango, multiple targets vicinity, L Tor VOR, one orbiting one thousand four hundred indicated tap unknown, the other one's a Cessna, they're uh, orbiting with two thousand four hundred. Radar service is terminated, squawk VFR, frequency change approved. Radar service terminated, squawk VFR, frequency change approved, seven zero tango. Looks like we're heading out to the Prax area. See. Let's take a quick Bravo, turn downwind. Turning downwind, AQ back Bravo. Let's lose some altitude. Yep, just like we're coming in from Signal P.
Let's take a gravel caution wing terminal terrible bus departing opposite direction off two left from a two zero left. Clear for the option. Two zero left, clear for the option. Take a back gravel. Oh, yeah. Uh, Rogue 2, Compass Rose, like so, to take off and land past 4. Definitely going to have some Rogue weight jumping there. Yeah, we can take our time. Okay. What do they say, like uh, 3 minutes? Usually, time it takes to dissipate. It can take up to 3 minutes. Yeah. Okay. Beam the numbers. 10 degrees. Stay a little bit higher. And start our base. <sighs> yeah, the name of the game on this one's being high. Like Cloud Rope 9. Pat, or Christian, uh, come through us clear for takeoff. Caution, <sighs> turbulence. Airbus departed off two left, wind two nine zero four. Fly southbound, and I'll call a westbound turn for right traffic to pad four. Okay, clear to take off. Uh, southbound, you follow the right turn. We'll use caution, road two. Very good. Taking your time, yeah. being stabilized. That's what it's all about. Plus, we have that guy yeah. crossing uh, the numbers on Lima, so. We're going to have to worry Rope about his turn, jet uh, westbound now for your right traffic. So I wouldn't be surprised Very if we're going to have to right traffic on this one. Okay. Yep, go 20. There you go, now start reducing some power. Didn't even bring it idle. So, we are going to practice a forward slip to landing. Okay. So, we're going to go left rudder. Right air alarm. Right aileron, but make sure that we maintain our airspeed. Rope two, do you have no, we're actually going to go right, right rudder. Okay, left aileron. Uh, traffic left aileron. Hey, rope two, uh, do not overfly them. They're going to the tower run up and then pad four, you're clear to land. Okay, well, you want to induce the uh, most uh, amount of drag on you can on ones like this. And now we're going to straight out yeah. and go straight into left rudder with right aileron. Oh, that killed my ear. Alright, a little bit more back pressure. A little bit more. A little bit more. Hold it. Hold it. I'm going 2805. Alright, and. Back to back. Yeah, and instant flaps up. Right aileron. Back to back, yeah. back to back to 2 zero left. Thank you, Bravo. And uh, I like to use a little bit more pressure on the right brake than the left. Okay. Let's take a quick Bravo, two zero left, taxi via Charlie Kilo. Two zero left via Charlie Kilo, exact Bravo. So, that's how you do a forward slip to landing. Alright. Now, was that on the, like, edge of, uh, you might want to go around here. Solo. <laughs> Let's go around, man. <laughs> yeah, because we were just obviously practicing that. Yeah, yeah. Um, yes, but um, if you're very, very proficient, not current, proficient right. with um, slips, I'd say it's okay. Um, you don't want to do it necessarily with too many flaps. Typically, like, most amount of flaps is 10 degrees. Okay. If not, no uh, flaps. Okay. These your airspeed. But um, I assumed that, you know, left rudder, right aileron would have done the trick, would have pinched us enough. Mm -hmm. It didn't. So we were kind of just, you know, if anything, crabbing towards the runway, so that's why I had to switch it up and go immediately to uh, right rudder into the wind Okay. and uh, left aileron gotcha. to really you know, bring us to the side to induce a lot of drag. So if we would have stuck with the other one, it would have been automatic go around. We wouldn't have landed. What's going on here? I don't know. <laughs> That kind of makes sense. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Oh yes. Oh okay, my gosh. Two zero left to kilo. Clear for takeoff. Two zero left to kilo. Clear for takeoff. Hey, get back, gravel. You ever like try to just have uh, funny accents? Yeah, yeah. My crew partner. Um, well, that's an ATP thing. 
Uh, I was flying up to Texas with one of my crew partners, and he was stellar with the accents. And man, did we have fuck with the controllers. That's funny. It was all right. Really good right. Time. Aileron. Brakes here. Go to twenty. All right. Full power. Yep. Get out of here, bird. Now, if a bird hits your wing or any kind of airfoil, uh -huh. I would suggest landing as soon as possible, okay. just in case. But I hit the it hit the propeller on mine, and it didn't phase anything. Okay. Not even the RPM, so I continued. Okay. Um, right. No traffic coming downwind. Clear left. Let's get three more good ones. Cool. You want to try also a door approach, power off? Yeah. Okay, cool. Want to do it on this one? Sure. Alright. Anchor Big Bravo would like to request a power off 180. Anchor Big Bravo, second request. We would like to request a power off 188, big problem. Okay, not familiar with that. Is that just like a short approach kind of thing? Yep, just like a short approach, take a big problem. Okay, big problem. That's proof is requested. Two zero left, you're clear for the option. And traffic looney two mile funnel. Roger that. We'll keep the, uh, looking for the parallel traffic and uh, two zero left, clear for the option. Thanks. Take a big problem. All right, so. Do you say two mile traffic? Uh, two mile, yep. All right, so when we are meeting the numbers. When we were beating the numbers, right. we Okay, so pull, idle. Pull power to idle. Laps. Nope. No. Nope. nope. You wanna. You wanna make it. You gotta do everything you gotta do. Okay. So as soon as you make, no, you can make it. Then you can do it. So All this right. is what we're gonna do. We're gonna kind of fly right around these do we buildings for, right uh, here. Do we pitch for 65 or no? Yes. Okay. Parallel traffic in sight, we'll maintain visual separation, and uh, thanks for the wind check, Anchor Big Problem. Yeah, no problem, and that citation won't cross. Roger that. Yeah, wind 2404, and caution wake turbulence, uh, 737 is going to depart for Anchor Big Problem. Roger that, we'll caution wake turbulence, Anchor Big Problem. So, right here, I would go 10 degrees. Okay. So, you, you need to do what you need to do. Now, the whole thing is you want to go immediately to 65. At 20? And yeah, yeah, you can add 20 now. And it's all about energy management. So, you know, uh, especially with, you know, traffic pattern stuff, it's okay. all about that 65. Do whatever you need to do. No steep turns because you don't want to lose all of your vertical lift. All right, a little bit more back pressure. Hold it a little bit more. So you're going to want a little bit more right aileron. Okay. Just a little bit. All right, now you can go. And rotate. Dog leg. Dog leg, yep. There we go. So, yeah, like I was saying, it's, it's all about energy management. Um, <coughs> you need to do what you need to do. Take any kind of approach that you theme is necessary, okay. but make sure you don't do steep turns, right? because you're just going to lose a lot of vertical lift, and you have to maintain 65 knots. From there, you know, like I said, it's way harder to maintain altitude than it is to lose altitude. Okay. So, when in doubt, slip it out, or flaps. Three nine and uh, indicating four thousand two hundred to stretch your descent for the pattern altitude. So, like right here, if we're gonna lose power, you, you ain't making it. Do it a one eighty. You gotta, you gotta go straight. But that's why I'm always, you know, stay left to the hangar because that's gonna be, you know, the make or break if you're gonna make the runway or not. If you're on the right side of the hangar or the left side of the hangar, you know. Right.
Let's take a look, Bravo, 2 to left, clear for the option. 2 zero left, clear for the option. We'd like to request another short approach if possible. Thank you, Bravo. Bravo, the short approach approved. Roger that, short approach approved. Thanks, thank you, Bravo. Okay. EPA is good there, center speed's at 80. And... Almost a B. Let's cut it. Boom. All right. It's at 65. 65. And start working your way towards. Yeah. Yep, there you go. Now, see these buildings? Yeah. I'd keep the bank coming. Okay. You're not going to want to mess around with those. Right. So, this is going to be a real short approach. As you can see, we're going to be turning over the numbers. Okay. 124 Delta Papa Jetline Tower, did you see your able to I'm at two zero. Now we're going to go 10 degrees right. flaps because uh, we know we're going to make it distance wise. It's yeah, a matter of lining tiger. ourselves Which up. Which runway did okay. you need to stay? Alright, now we're going to go 20 degrees of flaps. Okay. Uh, we'd like to take off in uh, 20 right, please. Uh, and since we're so high, we're going to go 30. Contact the tower on uh, 126.8. 126.8. You're going to have to slip a little bit. Yeah, nope. Okay. Uh, so nope. We're just going to use all the available runway. And now we're going to use quite a bit of right aileron because these 30 degrees of flaps are going to catch all the crosswind available. Okay. Go left rudder. Alright, now I'm going to take out all the flaps, just like that. As you can see... Back to two zero left, take a big problem. So with the crosswind, 30 degrees of flaps, so as you can see. Two zero left, taxi via Charlie Kilo. Two zero left via Charlie Kilo, take a big problem. As you can see, it just wants to just not sit. You kind of have to really force it to sit, but you have to like allow it to really stabilize itself first. Okay. So as soon as we were on the ground. And it was kind of like at the point that we were braking, I took flaps out. Okay. Really just got to take out all that drag. That's why I don't like using 30 degrees of flaps when we have winds like this. Right. But with an approach like that, we could have taken it out a little bit more. Um, and possibly slip to kind of avoid that. Okay, that's on 3 or Boeing 737 on the parallel. Where my what were the winds on that? I think it's just straight cross Yeah, wind 2407. So... <laughs> and it's an excessive amount of right rudder and forward aileron pressure to kind of have downforce, kind of like a supercar. You know what I mean? Yeah. Does that kind of make sense? Yeah, yeah. You don't want to wheelbarrow it, but you want to do have, you know, kind of an exaggerated little bit of forward aileron just to really kind of plan it. Hold on. Sorry about that. You all good? <sighs> um, couple more right. Regular three nine or square the base turn to follow one prior to rebel. Do one more, more solid landing. landing. Okay, cool. Take clear for traffic on base. Uh, two zero left to kilo clear for takeoff. No delay, please. Two zero left clear for takeoff uh, on kilo. No delay. Quebec Bravo. All right. Here we go. Yep. So now we're actually going to cut the corner. Cool. And then we don't have to stop. We can just. Just roll on. Roll out. Yep. Wind check. Alright, so there the wind sock. Yep, like that. So we're gonna have right aileron, full power. I got the controls. Okay, you got the controls. Well, now you now get the controls. Cool. So remember, we're gonna want to have a little bit of right aileron into the wind. Okay. As you can see, we're wanting to get lift. Alright, now that we have our airspeed. Now we're going to rotate. Okay, so Pop it. Let's start the offset as soon as we're able, please. I think that was for us. Yeah. What did he say? I think he said, like, hey, um... Fly over Alpha? Or? No, I think he said start the crosswind as soon as you can. Oh. Please. Do that? What? We can go crosswind? Yep. Okay. Three nine, thanks for the help. You can turn left at Hotel or Juliet and then contact ground one. Watch your airspeed. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
Six Bravo, nicely done. Traffic, uh, Astro Jet Team. Alright, so this one we're not going to want to use an excessive amount of flaps. That was to us. Three repeat for A, Quebec Bravo. Three Quebec Bravo, caution jet blast, traffic between the runways. Uh, traffic, Astro Jet Team, off on for the parallel two, zero left there for the option. Parallel drive again today, we'll maintain visual separation, caution wake turbulence, two zero left, clear for the option, A Quebec Bravo. A Quebec Bravo, A proof. Okay. Alright, so this one, let's do a 10 degree landing. 10 degree flaps? Okay. 10 degree flap landing. So, we're going to want to really kind of shallow out our approach. Okay. Not carry in too much speed. And this is for the event of a really, really heavy crosswind. Okay. Kind of like it is now. Okay. So do we want to go 10 immediately again and just hold stay it? Yeah, yeah, we can do okay. 10. Cool. But now we're just going to really keep our pitch constant. Yeah. But, you know, now we're going to have to manipulate power to really shallow out our approach. Okay and not carrying too much airspeed, we're going to want to maintain still around 65. Alrighty. Will do. These flaps will really try to carry you off the runway, like like last time. So is that just the tires uh, kind of yep. screeching? Yep. Trying to uh Well, they just weren't pushing. So we were just, we were just Scraping along the runway? Levitating. We were basically levitating. Okay. <laughs> All right. Clear final. Yep. Do a little uh, turn here. Not too steep. All right, so now we're going to reduce the power. Reduce. We're really just going to shallow out our approach. You can bring power idle. As you can see, we're moving. Lots of speed. So, we're going to trade airspeed for altitude. That's okay. the plan. Or a little power back in? Yeah, a little bit. And three. Center line. Two. Point two four zero eight. One. Just like that. I really did too much there. That was good. Cool. Now we're gonna go flaps up. That was very good. Okay. Cool. Tech specs up street. Cool. Right here? Yep. And Equip Bravo, one of the tech specs. Uh, we'll be taxiing back to Dev Street. Equip Bravo. Equip Bravo, Roger, contact ground, 120.8. Have a good one. Over to the ground, thanks. Equip back, Bravo. Number seven, Julia Zulu. Are you able to accept runway two zero left at Lima? All right, we can uh, accept uh, two zero left at Lima. Triple seven, Julia Zulu. Number seven, Julia Zulu. Roger, runway two zero left. The taxi via Alpha Hotel Charlie. Hold short of Lima. Alpha Hotel Charlie. Two zero left. Hold short of Lima. Triple seven, Julia Zulu. Still my ground. Cessna one eight two seven November. Executive taxi midfield run up with November. November 1827, November, Dunway Ground, Taxi Midfield, Ground up via Alpha. Uh, taxi Midfield via Alpha, 27 November. Dunway Ground, Cessna 738 Quebec Bravo is clear of 20 left at Juliet, taxi back to Death Street. November 738 Quebec Bravo, Dunway Ground, Taxi via Alpha to be, correction, Taxi via Charlie to the Midfield, Run up and hold. Taxi to uh, Midfield, Run up via Charlie and hold at Quebec Bravo. Good job today. Thanks. November 52056, taxi via Bravo Tower run up, caution rotor wash. Tower to run up, uh, Bravo to tower run up 056. Bird strike on the taxiway. <laughs> uh, the bird deserves it then. Yeah, what you going for, bud? <laughs> That's funny. 
All right, so I know we have a uh, we have a that Cessna ahead coming in. Okay, so we're so we're really right. Seven November caution. There's a Cessna entering the midfield runoff. Off the, the right. Yeah. Cessna's inside. Two seven November. November eight Quebec. A Bravo caution for opposite direction. Cessna for the midfield runoff. Roger. Eight Quebec Bravo. November 8, Quebec Bravo, hold for the Pilatus to pass, and then taxi to the southeast run-up via Alpha. All right, we'll hold for the Pilatus and then taxi to the southeast run-up via Alpha, Quebec Bravo. What kind of plane is that? That's a little tail dragger. Oh, that one? Yeah. That's a... Uh, 152? No, it's 172, it's 1946. Oh, dang. Yeah. Um, my buddy owns it. I don't know who's flying it, though. American 1456 clearing at Echo for gate 7. American 1456 downway ground, turn left onto Alpha and hold for an opposite direction Cessna to turn off the taxiway and then continue via Alpha the gate. We'll turn left here, we'll hold then Alpha gate will be clear. American 1456. Compass 5812 gate 6. Especially with these high wings, these high wings just snag everything. Compass 5812 downway ground, push back approved till north. Push approved till north, Compass 5812. Cessna 8, Quebec, and Bravo, hold for American to pass, caution jet blast, and then continue via Alpha to Dove Street. All right, we'll hold for the American, and then continue uh, via Alpha to Dove Street, Echo at Bravo. Spot of 7, uh, Juliet Zulu, contact tower, 119.9er. 119.9er. Nine 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 Going ground, Looney 1017. Do we usually want to have our wing inside here? Looney 1017, Charlie, down the ground. Uh, Looney 1017, Charlie, text to Bravo to park. Good. All right. I mean, yeah, typically. I just like lining up with it. Okay. Ground Cessna 1827 November, midfield run up complete, ready to continue. Cessna 1827 November, runway 20 left, taxi via Charlie Kilo. 20 left, uh, Charlie Kilo, 27 November. Love it. Is that South Africa? Compass 5812, are you going to push? Yeah. I yeah, think it might be. I don't know what's going on. I think our ramp crew is just finishing up a check or something, but they uh, should be pushing right. soon. Compass 5812, Roger, hold on the gate and call me when you're ready. All right, well, we were holding hey, on the gate. Off. We were just moving when you. 